Hello guys, this is uh, R2D2 here today, and today, this is this is going to be my first review video, and I don't know why I'm really doing this review, I just really like uh, Razer products, because as you can see in the title, we are do reviewing the uh, Synapse, or Razer Synapse 2.0, and I don't know really what I can really review about it though, I just kind of was like sitting here like, oh, what should I do, but uh... Just bring my thoughts about it. Now, Razer products, as you can see, I have the Razer Death Adder, the older version. They now have a new version of it, I think. Yeah, I think so. And the uh, Black Widow. It's an older one, so it's not too advanced, and it's kind of loud, as you guys can obviously hear in all my videos. But anyways, I'm not reviewing those this video. But the Synapse is, like setup hard drive thingy thing thing is very nice because you can completely customize your like mouse or keyboard or anything like that so like for example I for some reason for I made the button E so whenever I'm playing Minecraft I don't have to move my finger but I think I'm getting rid of that because it's kinda of pointless but then with the macros I created a spam bot which is very easy to make. I well, all you have to do is what I did to make this one is I put it on no delay, and then I just did like you. What you'd have to do is to copy. Like I'll even let's open up a word thing. What I have to do is let's type in hi. Command C. Let me do something. Alright, so I would have to write down that down. Now I'm just gonna add command A. It's not working. Okay. I'll just manually underline it. And copy it. And then with my spam bot, because it's left command or whatever, like just copy and then that's like paste. That's my like command V is paste. So what I did is command V, command V, enter, or return, which, like on Skype or Facebook messaging, that's what the uh, thing is. So then I just have to press the button, and it just does that. Mine, because there's like zero delay in any of it, can type about 665-ish messages a thing. That's one, one thing you can do with. Um, macros on the synapse. Another thing you can do is uh, like if you have a certain t like what can I say like if you're playing some MMO and you want like a chain reaction of different things like let's say you want you I don't play any MMOs but if you have <laughs> this is showing how much I know about MMOs but if you have like some kind of attack thing where it shoots out lightning and then something afterwards that you that like increases it or something you can like click the buttons in the order that you need them to and then just bind them to one key like on here I have my fast spam bot on this key right here and I also have it on like the mouse which is very useful just to have it right there instead of having to uh, manually do it sometimes and anyways Another thing that's really nice is on most Razer products there are like lights on them. So with the keyboard, you can either just turn it off, you can have it mid, or you can have it pulsate, and then obviously that with the mouse. Go over to here, you can just completely turn them off. Whoa, I glitched out. Now my mouse is completely dark, but I like it with my things on. But one thing another thing you can do in the most mouses, I think all of them anyway, the calibration of their sensitivity, like that and that. I don't really wanna get into all the specifics of customization, but yeah. It's just a kind of overview. And one thing you can do is you can have multiple things, like for let's go over to my mouse you can have multiple settings. Right now I'm on normal, but then if I go 
over to gaming, my sensitivity is higher. Like, let's click it again. And you can see it's moving because I have my presets and there's a button on the bottom of the mouse that changes it. So that's a really nice thing. And that can also be done with the keyboard, but I don't really do that because I don't really need anything special with my keyboard because I only really play Minecraft, TF2, and some other games like Gmod and stuff. But uh, yeah, this is just kind of a short, pointless review of Synapse 2.0. Um, if you have any questions about more how to do macros, then let me know in the comments, and I will sure to be making a video about that, and yeah, thanks for watching. Have a nice day.